In this section, there are six questions for you to answer. You will be required to record your response with video. You will only be given one, one attempt to record your response. Each question will have its own time limit. Once you submit your answer, you cannot change it. And you will be taken to the next question. Right. So why do you want to work for Red Bull? Highest cheers um, most people drink. Hi Kiora, Namaste. I'm Belram and the reason I want to work for Red Bull is because Red Bull energy drink has got the highest share of any energy drink sold throughout the world. And Red Bull also sponsor lot, if not all major adventure sports throughout the world. So it would be a good opportunity for me to work for a successful brand that has been operating throughout the world. And I know I can offer a lot to be successful in this role. Please click the button below when you are ready to continue to the next question. Yes, I think I am ready. What attracted to apply for territory manager role? I, I have more than five years retail and hospitality management experience and I'm working at Trade Depot as sales consultant at the moment and I think territory manager or the sales territory manager would be a really good opportunity for me to implement my um, problem solving skills, relationship building skills uh, that I have been applying in most of my jobs and careers throughout my career um, and I have always been successful in building great relationship and been able to win the hearts of the customers so based on utilizing those skills that I have I'm pretty sure I can do a good job uh, so that's why I applied for this territory manager role are you ready for the next question yes I am Bring it on, baby. Bring it on. What are your career goals? How do you think this position will support this? Mm, career goal is definitely to stay um, in a business for a long time. Stay long, reputed business. Uh, this role will definitely support. My career goals are to stay in a business that's already successful and have achieved a really good reputation across the world or at least within New Zealand. It's a really popular brand and to be with a business where I can see myself growing within the business 
and take it take my career to the next uh, level in coming years and i'm pretty sure being a territory manager will be able to help me achieve my career goals in coming years are you ready for the next question yeah baby i am bring it on sorry Tell me about your current position. How do you think your skills and experience fit the striker role requirement? Current position, if I skills and experience. I, I work at Trade Depot as a sales consultant. As soon as a customer walk in, my job is to interact with them, greet them, explain them about the products, about their uses, and make a sale without even realizing that you are, without fo forcing a customer to buy from you. So you explain them in a nice, polite manner, and eventually they are likely to buy from you. And, and you think, and my experience has been mainly with hospitality and retail in last sort of seven to eight years. And I've always been able to go, build good relationship with my colleagues as well as with my customers. And I believe that customer is the king in the business. They pay your wages, so you need to be treating them really nice. And that's one of my core skill. Also, I have, great organizational skills i make a note of the things that i need to prioritize and i work based on the priority and my enthusiastic nature would be an add-on skill to the business that uh, will have great relationship with with my team as well as um and i'm sort of a person who would support and develop others if needed and i stay calm under stress so I'm pretty sure the experience and the skills that I would bring on the table would be really good for this role and I would be able to successfully do my job because I believe you do your job to the best of your abilities and you would go home happy. I'm ready for the next question anyway. Give an example when you have exceeded your target, what measures did you put in place in order to for this to happen? I when I worked at Keen store we were given a store target of achieving certain numbers um e every month and considering it was a newer business so they thought that the business won't be doing as much so we have doubled as a team we have doubled and I was the assistant manager there my job was to look after the store uh, since the store manager was the multi-store manager, so I was managing the store as a sole charge in this. And my job was to train my team and exceed the customer expectations. And what I did is explain my team that this is what we need to go through. This is our target. And we need to be upselling. We need to be suggestive selling. We need to be explaining them customers about the benefit and add on value, adding the value, sell a little bit expensive product to add value to that sale. So by doing these smaller things, but really effective, we have been able to achieve as a team, I would say, but I took the initiative to, to do that. And we doubled the target. We doubled the KPI targets that were given to us. And then we achieved the monthly bonuses based on that. And the management was really happy, Sto uh, head office was happy. And the typical measures that we took is training of the team and making sure that everyone is on the same place.
and they understand what we expect from the team and what hero face is expecting out of us but you feel happy when you achieve and go beyond your target last question i would say finish the sentence at barbecue i'm most likely to be a guy who is enjoying the barbecue having a good conversation knowing each other at barbecue i'm most likely to be the guy who is trying to interact with almost everyone getting to know them um in their personal life as well as uh, their professional career and if there is anything for me to learn obviously i will to take that on board and i'm sort of person who would try to bring on some games where you can interact with each other and you can make friends and get to know each other obviously have fun um, and share some jokes and ha- have a good time and most probably making making good friends thank you so